I'm at my uh, buddy's house who got the tire. How many people did it take to move it? Three of us. <laughs> really? <laughs> How much do you think it weighs? Roll it. I would think 400 just because, like, I had 100 pounds on the tailgate and I can pick up two without any problem. Wow. I would think it's close to four. Maybe it's 400. 350, maybe. Maybe, maybe even close to five. You never know. I don't know. That thing's heavy. I'm, heavy. I'm, I'm happy that you, you're going to use it. <laughs> this is cool. Yeah. Carved marble. Our was that from a storage room? Yeah. Hey, a hippo. You got that one right, Dar. It was abstract. This up. I know you messed a lot of antique stuff, so I didn't know what you were. This one's fun. This is an old. Uh, somebody turned it into a bank, but it's for. Uh... But there's some older stuff in here. I think so. We got some books too. I don't know what to do with the books. Mm -hmm. I got here. What about the glass? Nah, it's almost. Nice salt and pepper shakers with the bunnies. What do you want on the rabbits? I'm going to. Everything here is you want it, you can have it. What, for letting you know about that tire? Yeah. All right. All right. You help me out, I'll help you. I appreciate that. I didn't make it to the flea market today, so. There's something else I wanted to show you. You may be able to have a better idea what to do with this. Are they slides or? Yes, the pictures. From, from freaking, uh, Let me see the slide holder. Areas. It's really so nice. I don't want to get rid of it. Is this all from storage room or? Yeah. So this one came from a family. Uh, uh, I believe in the Drop 70s flowers. and 80s. Check out that pinky bank. It's a cool one. Uh, from the 70s. Another rabbit one. I like the. Here, show me the slide holders. See, sometimes these are metal, and what's nice about the metal ones is you can fit your slab coins in them. But they, they always sell at the market. Are you going to set up at the flea market? Later. Because it is open now. Yeah. This guy's fun. Little wood, uh, actually, this is good. Here, this is from this is actually an old sleigh bell, so it'll go on the horse's collar. Yeah, I buy these at the flea market whenever I see them. <laughs> at least he's having fun riding bikes. You don't have any, uh, a kid likes Pokemon cards. You don't have any of those from storage rooms, do you? I mean, uh, maybe your grandkids like like it too. Does this one have a top, do you know? I don't know. It'd be good as deer, Yeah, it does. It's right here. Oh, I see a little frog. Two little frogs. Put those in the garden. What is this thing? Oh, that's real cool. Dad. Dad. That's that's like a pop-up, a pop-up Victorian card. You know what? I have something freaking really. I know it's a. These are really nice. Thank you. Hey, Dad. Yeah, Dar. What's up? I'm not a bike. Well, you, you don't need a bike. You have plenty.
vulture. That's kind of fun. Oh, it's an ashtray. It's even better. That sounds like buttons. Let's see if I'm right. Yeah, it's a good vintage box of buttons. Probably from the 50s. So they, did you see they switched all the storage rooms? Like it went on the site yesterday? How are they doing it now? Everything's going to be online? Okay, eh, sometimes. I don't like it. It's, it's always mis, um, mis, uh, deceiving. Yeah, you can end up spending way too much way money too on much junk. Money. Yep, I've done that. The, the reason I don't like the online storage rooms, you don't have smell-o-vision yet. So you can't yeah. tell if it's a... Uh, Bad in here or, not. or if it's moldy or not. Yeah. That's cool. This is a really cool book. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so to, for social distancing, they don't want to do the live auctions. Until when? Till. Uh, I don't know. I. I just saw it on uh, on the website yesterday, and I I I thought it was going to pour this morning, so I didn't go to the market. It's supposed to rain real bad this afternoon. You know, if this was a old bottle, not a repop, it would be like four or five hundred bucks. <laughs> but guess what? That's an old bottle. <laughs> well, no, no, no. It's th th these are all. They, they remade all these in the 70s. Oh, okay. But it. Because where I, I'm telling you, you know, I got it from? They really have some nice things in there. In that unit? Yeah, in that unit. It was an uh, older couple that had it. Well, honestly, I would have I would have paid good money for these two pop up cards. So I really appreciate it. Uh, sure. All right, I'm going to. I'm just going to take one box, is that right? Take whatever you want. That's why I brought it all this. This is all Christmas. What is this Those thing? Oh, this is a tripod. But th these actually sell sometimes. Take it. It's all for you. Man, it cooled down. It was so hot and humid earlier. <laughs> So, are you going to use that uh, tire for for you, or are you going to are you going to start a start another gym? Yeah, I'm going to start another gym too. I'll wait till this thing passes over. Last thing I want to do is open up and you can tell us to shut down. That makes sense. Yeah. I really like this belt buckle. I'm going to cut that off. With that belt. Okay. That's pretty cool. Okay. Don't play with that, Dar. Eh, I don't see too much in there that I particularly need. I just kind of like the the snakehead belt buckle. Okay. This from inside. I'm, I'm pretty sure this is a cut paper calling card. You can, you can see how it's like two or three different. Uh, that's that's really nice. Yeah, it's cool. Um, it says uh, when's it from? It says in the back, it says 1866. My my guess is it has a name on the other side. It looks like it was framed in the 50s or 60s on, on a nice piece of velvet. Yeah. Uh, it came from the same unit with the yeah, with yeah. the pop-up cards? Mm -hmm. That's pretty cool. pretty cool. When was the last time you did a unit? <laughs> you haven't done one recently, have you? Four months ago was the last time. Yeah, they had, a, they had a couple... So I'm going to take this box here, okay. and I'm going to. Do you want these or no? No, that's what I'm saying. I mean, I, I could I could use them. Okay, take them. I got more. Yeah, I have a I have a guy who buys all that. Uh, okay. Let me help you with this. Are these worth anything? Which ones? Oh, which one? oh, the mannequins. 
Um, let me see that one. They sell at the market. Yeah. They're good for uh, dis display. He's gonna take these two. Okay. Yeah, all those are old. Like, you got it from this place. Yeah, that's why we, we didn't want to give it because it was old. Have you done uh, Have you done Columbus on a Thursday? Yeah, it's, it's okay. I mean, it's not the greatest, but I know, I know. <laughs> none none of them are the greatest. But they're all. The you can have all of those. Because we were just gonna trash. <laughs> well, I appreciate it. Yes, you are. <laughs> what the heck is this? Is this a Halloween costume? No, it's a Santa stuff. I don't know. I like this Santa Claus. He's kind of odd. Which one were you talking about? Oh. I didn't know what it was. Because we had that for a while. I like your marble statue. That was pretty cool. I stepped on it. Okay. Sorry. He right he here. mentioned it. He mentioned it after I stepped on it. Taylor, a good book for you right like my <laughs> <laughs> I know I stepped on one. Today too, one. So we're gonna block that this area. Here, Dave. Go right on the top of this. Uh, you you taking this or no? On the book. like it's up to you. No, I'm not gonna. I, I'm just grabbing that one nature book. You got it. I think I'm just going to take this odd Santa and the old elf on the shelf type things. Yeah, Dar. All right, I'll, I'll come play with you in one minute. Almost done. You're waiting nice and patiently. See, whenever I take them to the storage rooms, exactly, that's what he likes to do. <laughs> What is that one? Uh, no. All right. Threw in this calling card. All right. It was for me that one little box, and I didn't have to bust my butt moving this big tire. It was definitely worth it. Um, I'm gonna go check his uh, storage, see if they got anything uh, I can buy. But I like that pot. It's kind of fun. Well, made it back home. Definitely uh, was really happy with these pop-up cards. I've never had uh, Victorian pop-ups before. Um, I really like the frames that they made for them, the little shadow box. I bet they'll do fairly well. Uh, but it was definitely a good little box of treasures. These were uh, Goble. And I wonder if that is too. Yep. The mother rabbit. So, actually, it's ice skating. <laughs> but definitely got some fun things. I uh, been working in the garden. Definitely have been uh, impressed how things have been growing. We uh, just finished planting the last flower bed. All the we got zinnias and cosmos on this this end down here, but the, the tomato seemed to be working pretty well. But the thing that I was amazed by was the size of this broccoli. I mean, all the other ones are small, but this one just decided to take off and grow into a monster. Definitely. You, you buy stuff smaller than that at the grocery store a lot of the time. So that definitely made my day. I planted some, because uh, the sun comes this way, like faces, faces us. I planted some uh, real interesting pole beans uh, that get these nice bright yellow flowers to grow up on this side of the tomatoes. And they actually seem like they're growing up the string what I've been doing is just uh, weaving them every morning. Like, just put the put the leaf on the other side, and it tends to just spin right up 
the top. So you can see all the tomatoes seem to be, I don't know, pretty well trained. I put these little loops to hold these together because I feel like those are going to snap. Um, just tied little square knots on a couple pieces of rope. Carrots are getting huge. Um, I have spent a lot of time uh, thinning them and I'm actually getting impressed how big the carrot is getting. Uh, so I guess when, as soon as we eat all the baby carrots I just picked, we'll thin them one more, one more time to give, give them some more space. And uh, I bet we'll get 100 pounds, 200 pounds of carrots off this little square. It's about, I'd say about 10 foot by four foot, four and a half foot. So I don't know, just figured I had to show you that in the garden. Definitely was, uh, definitely was impressed by that. The little uh, pole beans that or peas all have flowers now, so we should actually get peas from them. I didn't think it was going to happen. And the fingerling potatoes just started to flower too. They have this little uh, nightshade looking flower. But I would think uh, we should actually get some potatoes off of this row. So. Definitely was a good day. Um, never know what we're going to find and definitely paid to give my friend a call about that big tire. Uh, be interesting to see what those uh, cards do online. All right. See everybody later. If you haven't yet, please give somebody a call. Um, please be safe out there. And thank you very much for watching. Peace. Uh, cabbage butterfly. They actually, I'm going to show you what, so the little, this little white guy, I don't know if you can quite follow it, he's going fast, but they're, they eat the broccoli. I think I got rid of most of the little ones, but you can see it has all these little holes. Here you go. See the little caterpillars? And basically you just have to wipe them off, but they uh, they'll eat all of the leaves if you leave them on. Sounds like a uh, thunderstorms are coming. It's time to go. See, there's another one. They'll go all uh, all spring and fall. Yep, here's you can see the little caterpillar. You just don't want them to get into your broccoli head. I mean, I guess it's one way to get protein if you're a vegetarian. All right, see you later. One more big one over there. Almost looks like diamonds on the leaf.